the internet drama was beginning to die down a bit. We end, have, end of episode two. You're done. We're done now. We have a new wild and wacky development here, but this time on YouTube and involving cheating, but not like the anal bead chest cheating. This cheating doesn't involve butt plugs or anal beads at all. Why not? This one involves a man who was unfaithful to his wife. I'm talking about the Try Guys, Ned Fulmer. The Try Guys are a massive channel, have been for a long time, and yesterday they posted this message letting people know that Ned Fulmer would no longer be working the with the Try the Guys. After this was posted, all of the information oh, began to banner. surface as to why. There's a video picture evidence that confirms that Ned Fulmer cheated on his wife with a, a workplace associate for quite some time, I believe. And it was a, a big mess, a, a big, stinky, filthy mess. Uh, I went over the situation on stream, and I'll show you the clips from that, but what? I think it's very important to highlight that Ned Fulmer's entire identity revolved around how much he loved his wife. Like, I swear to God, it was like he took a goddamn love potion from Harry Potter because half the shit he would talk about in the videos was how much he loved his wife. And then it turns out he was cheating on her. So yeah, just a giant scumbag shit stain, and the entire community was some, really caught some. off guard by this, obviously. Super shocked to learn that Ned Fulmer was a cheater. That would be like if you yeah, guys I learned I secretly is. enjoyed Burger King. I am publicly insulting them all the time, saying how bad Fuck they are, King. comparing their food to nuclear sludge. But imagine all of that's just a lie, and it turns out that I actually love Burger King, and I'm I boofing Whoppers King. in my bathtub every night. You would be shocked and feel betrayed just even learning that about me. So I think the audience definitely felt that because they were all under the impression that Ned Fulmer was a very family first kind of guy. He has kids as well. So no one really thought Ned Fulmer would Wait. be a piece of shit like this. Wait. So very sad situation overall. Uh, I'll go ahead and play the stream moments that really showcase the whole situation a bit more. But I yeah, wanted I to gonna, give you I, the I general gonna, gonna overview say, here of I'm what's going on. So I think most people are familiar with the Try Guys, I would imagine. Try Guys uh, no, are a nope. huge channel and have been for a very long time. And one of the members has recently been accused of being unfaithful. Is, to that, his is it wife. that bad? A wife whom he would constantly brag about and mention how much he loves his wife and respects his wife. In fact, he even posted a whole compilation of it. Yes. Guys, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not being rude. Watch the video. Okay, I'm not gonna say anything then. I'm just gonna wait. This is Ned. And the love he feels for his wife. My wife, my wife. 52 my wife, months. My wife, let's go, my wife, juice. My wife, 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 my wife. Yeah, so it's like straight out of Borat with the whole my wife thing. So he talks about his wife a lot. Okay. He mentions his wife a ton. Always positively, too. Yeah, it says, bad because dating employee, he was her boss. Okay, is that like a power dynamic type shit? You know, everyone was shocked when they heard it was Ned who cheated on his wife. I'm not allowed to Because this man, with everything he said, treated her like an angel. Viewed her like a goddess. And yet, he was tempted by the forbidden fruit. He allegedly... Well, not even allegedly. He fucking confirmed it. Here's his post. He, he, he had an affair. A consensual workplace relationship. The, the employee... Family should have always been my priority, but I lost focus and had a consensual workplace relationship. Sorry for any pain that may actions may have caused to the guys and the fans, but mostly to Ariel. What the fuck? Is that his wife? The only thing that matters now is my marriage and my children. That's where I tend to focus my attention. Okay. That he had, or I believe it was an employee, or maybe just like a work associate. Uh, the person that people are thinking it is was a woman who was also engaged. And her fiance found double, out double. and removed every picture of her from his Instagram. And, you know, you can start connecting the dots here. You don't have to be, you know, the, the smartest guy in the world to, to follow Double the trail bogey. of breadcrumbs. So, Ned fucked, a, fucked a, a woman that wasn't his wife and also fucked another dude's wife. He respects his wife so much he had to cheat on her because he's unworthy of her love. <laughs> Yeah, maybe that's it. XQC. Uh, there's also some really dumb. beautifully aged clips here. 
That is cheating. Uh, I'm calling. What if it goes? What if it goes double double and then no, I'm not. It makes weird. I'm not gonna say weird shit. It's just. It's just cheating. Uh, I'm calling it. Ned, it's cheating. That is cheating. How right you I'm were. I'm calling it. Ned, it's cheating. That is cheating. The intuition truly was right on the money. Sometimes you just gotta go with the gut feeling. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a dumb thought. Okay, I just, I just thought. What if, what if the cheated on, then, then, matched up with the cheated on, and then it went full circle. And now Ned has been removed from the Try Guys. Think about it. Which is big. I mean, that's big. Losing that job is... You said that too, right? That's See, not, not an not easy pill to swallow. Wife swap! He has two kids, right? He has some kids. I don't know how many. I will be fully open. I'm not overly familiar with Ned or the Try Guys. I, of course, have watched their content from time to time, but I wouldn't consider myself like a connoisseur. Yeah, I don't know their, their ins and outs. I didn't even know Ned was married. I, I thought the whole what, my wife thing was like a running gag or something. But why is it that big of a scandal, though? So he tried an affair. He did. I don't think he liked the results very much so far, but the jury's still out. Why fire him, though? Because it's a bad image. He's, he's now a flight risk. That happens with everything. It's not just like you. What? Is he a flight risk? What? Bad image. He's, he's now a flight risk. That happens with everything. It's not just like YouTube or anything. Literally, that happens everywhere. 15k quote tweets. I know this is man. This man caught a storm. Yep. So did the company fire him or did he leave? Twitter people. Are, Twitter people are fans of Try Guys. It's a big deal for them. Oh, okay. Bro, you think Ned Fulmer left? No, man. He got fired. And obviously, their entire brand is based on their personalities and people liking them and enjoying them. No one likes a cheater. What about so who cares? That immediately Bro, I just need to drama. I'm not allowed to watch it. I'm not allowed to watch it. It's a big problem I'm in contact for the brand. with my environment. Thus, my they environment. got rid of him for it. And his whole brand was how much he loved his wife. True. The love and respect he had for his wife was one of like his crucial tenets, like a Ten Commandment he'd follow. Interesting. Five on his wife is that even legal? Nah, no, I think it, I think I think he got um. No, he was, he, he was, he was having a relation with the person he wore, that he was boss to, in the workplace. I don't think you could do that. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh. so fucked why, why did they fuck up so bad though you guys Man, push fuck down. Man, where that shit at? Get the fuck. 
Just get the fuck up, bro. Oh, whoa. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, bro. The fuck will be the hell out of here. Fuck that. I'm gonna beat that bitch ass. I ain't get the fuck out of me, look like. You little ugly bitch. Okay, I'm done. I'm done.